time. In this recording, I will show you how to do tutorial 9, question 6 on statistics. There are 40 test scores organized in the frequency distribution table as shown. We are going to compute the mean, the variance, and standard deviation by using the calculator. Before we use the calculator, we must compute the class mark of each classes. There are five classes. The first class is from 51 to 60. The class mark is 55.5. This is the average of 51 and 60. Similarly, we can find the class mark for the second class is 65.5, for the third class is 75.5, for the 4th class is 85.5, for the 5th class is 95.5. Once we have finished computing the class mark, we are ready to set up the calculator to do the statistical calculation. So let me turn on my calculator. So to set up the calculator for statistical calculation, we need to do set up, which is shift, set up here. If you press shift, set up, and then you go down and look for statistic so three for statistic so we look for three and then we're going to turn on the frequency distribution table so we press one so we have set up the calculator correctly now to do the calculation you must set the mode correctly the mode so go to the mode there mode and statistical calculations for two since we are calculating mean Variance and standard deviation, they are one variable under one. So we're going to press one. All right, now we enter the data. The first number we enter is 55.5, the first class mark 55.5, then equal to enter the data. The next number is 65.5, so we enter 65.5, then equal. The third number is 75.5, so we entered 75.5, then equal. The fourth number is 85.5, so we entered 85.5, then equal. The fifth number is 95.5, so we entered 95.5, then equal. Once we finish the class mark, so we go to the right and go all the way to the top to enter the frequency. The first frequency is 6, so we enter 6, then equal. Second frequency is 10, so we enter 1, 0, equal. The third frequency is 14, so we type 1, 4, equal. And the fourth frequency is 7, so we enter 7. The fifth frequency is 3, so we enter 3 equal. So we have completely transfer the information to my calculator. To do a calculation, we need to press 1, okay, which is above the button 1 and stack calculation. So we need to press shift 1 first. Shift 1, and we are calculating variable mean, variance, and the duration. 5 is for variable. So we press 5. The symbol for mean is x bar which is number two so you press two and then equal so the mean is 73.25 next we're going to find the standard deviation before you do that you must delete this 73.25 so press delete and the table go back to the original table to do the cal calculation again you press shift one and then 5 for variable. Now the standard deviation, the symbol is x sigma a minus 1, number 4. So you press 4, and then equal. So you find that the standard deviation is 11 by 4, 3, 2. Or 11 by 4, 3, 2, 6. Alright, so once we have found the standard deviation, we can find the variance. The variance is a square standard deviation. So 
So to find the variance, we need to go to the computation mode. So you go to the mode there, select mode, and computation mode is 1. Then you enter the standard deviation, 11 point four three two six, And then we square, you get the variance, square, equal. So you find that the variance is 130 130.70. Uh, 130.70 that is the end of the solution for tutorial 9 question 6